Hi folks, I'm Tom, welcome back to my channel. I'm pretty excited because although autumn is now definitely upon us, the summer is breathed its last gasps, it did so in style. Now, what recently happened around my neck of the woods, this is my neck of the woods here, this is St. Andrews, this is the place I usually dive, uh, I do quite a lot of fishing around here as well. It's a shallow, uh, sandy bottom with nice rocky, reefs in amongst it around the edge of the town. It's um, very rarely really clear, but on this occasion it was pretty nice. And this is about as good as it's going to get around here. But what we've been seeing lots of around here at the moment is white bait. And these are juvenile herrings. Now I don't know where they go and I don't know what they do the rest of the time, but in the summer they come in in big numbers. Now I've heard anecdotes that in years gone by, these were here in huge numbers, like the sea was just black with them and that they were heavily fished out. And in some years, you know, in recent decades, there's been none. So it's really nice to see the herrings, juveniles coming back. These flashes are my strobes because I've also got my underwater camera rig uh, running as well. Here's an example of one of the pictures I took. I put all my stuff on, on Flickr as well. so link in description down below. You could see the fish actually fizzling on the surface. There was something interesting them. You could see them bubbling there. And you just dip below the surface and, and then there they are. It turns out there was a bit of a scum on the surface. And as I swam further, I hit big clouds coming from a nearby sewage pipe, which was lovely. So I turned and swam a good mile in the other direction to find some clear water and I hit this nice little shoal of pollock. Now pollock have been in really short supply around this uh, part of the world this year. I don't know why. But it's, so it's lovely to see some you know, decent numbers of these things coming back because in fact all the fish really around our way have been uh, hardly there at all this year. So this was a real unusual dive. Nothing big though, just tiddlers of all varieties. So I had a lovely little dive but then, right, I was getting changed in the car park and I just looked out over the sort of glassy water and I thought, well, usually when it's glassy and it's summery, you've got a good chance of seeing dolphins. So as I was getting changed, sure enough, saw some dolphins. I remembered I had the drone in the back of my car. So, yeah, pop the drone up. By the time you fumble around, do this turning around thing to calibrate it, whatever, I can't see the dolphins anymore. So I used a whole battery flying around the area looking for the dolphins. Brought the thing home, thought, well, well I'll stick another battery and send it back out again. And then on the second flight, hit the jackpot. Got the drone right over a bunch of dolphins. I think there was about five or six in total. And what these guys are doing is feeding on the white bait. And you can see them twisting and turning in the water. Enjoying a really good feed on these tasty little fish. And these are really tasty little fish. Perhaps not the ones that have been munching on St. Andrew's finest effluent, but in general, juvenile herrings, white bait, delicious. So I, I, I sympathize with these dolphins wanting a good feed. I was standing on the beach uh, because it was a sunny day and I couldn't see the controller. So to actually try and track these things in any meaningful sense using my little drone was pretty tricky. So I took my t-shirt off and pulled it over my head and put the controller up inside so I could actually see the screen of it. It's lovely to watch their behavior, isn't it? You see that pair there zooming along together. Absolutely stunning. I was so excited by this, by the way. Like, this was just marvellous. What I'd give to be in the water with these guys, though. Now, it's not just the dolphins having a good feed on these um, white bait. Also, the seabirds. Now, something's been going on with the seabirds around our way lately. Uh, there's been a lot of dead ones washing up, mainly guillemots and things like that. 
Um, they're supposed to be, I believe, correct me if I'm wrong, please, I'm not an expert on this, but they're supposed to be about 50 miles offshore out in the middle of the North Sea at the moment. And they're not, they're inshore and dying. And apparently the ones that are dying have been emaciated. They're, they're starving, basically. Uh, so there's a lot of dead birds washing up. Now, these little white bait have arrived, and then the birds that haven't starved are inshore where they shouldn't be, and then now they're having a bonanza. So the ones we, you do come across actually look pretty happy. I think this is a guillemot. Again, please correct me if I'm wrong. I'm not well up on my seabirds. Um, I don't think it's a razor bill or something like that. But anyway, if you, if you know what this is, comment down below. But there's thousands of them. And what they're doing is they're driving the white bait against the rocks. And this is looking down into the water from above. And they're hammering them against the rocks so the white bait have got nowhere to go. And you can see the birds, look, they, 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 oh, they swim like fish underwater. And I saw a load of these when I was diving, but I didn't have my GoPro with me because that was a different occasion. It was the day before when I was uh, shooting with my camera. It's so nice to see loads of fish and life abundant in the sea. It's been a really barren year for sea life around here. So to see the big shoals of white bait and the sunshine, see the dolphins eating them, see the seabirds coming in, having their fill, and just, just the wee golden pollock, simple thing like that. When you've been missing them, and you see them come back, it's, it's really nice. Um, I'm not sure what's going on with the starving seabirds, to be honest. Um, I hope it's just fluctuations, you know, good years, bad years, that kind of thing. But with all that's going on in the world, it's impossible to say. But sure enjoyed that little weekend um, in St Andrews in the east of Scotland. Next video coming up is a catch and cook of the white bait. Went out with Wee Freya, netted a load. So I'll, I'll show you that coming up soon on the channel. Some really nice comments again on the channel. Thank you very much. Um, seems like you guys really enjoy this. I only do it for my own fun. So <laughs> glad you guys enjoy it too. Right, thanks very much for watching folks. See you on the next video. Cheers, bye bye.